I got uh, bad news and good news. What do you want me to start oh, with? Oh, start with the good news or bad, start with the bad news. Everybody yeah, start, start with the bad, bad, start with the bad news. Yeah. Okay. I thought you were a music connoisseur here. <laughs> You sit in the back and they drive you to wherever you want to go. Great. What? I'm a pearl, I'm a uber, I'm a I'm a pearl, I'm a I'm a pearl, 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 I'm you like, driver, send me to this fucking, you have to send that literally, you know what I mean? <laughs> Jazzing released the statement. Like, I don't want. Thank you. Nice, man. They filled up. Okay, so the question is the filling up of the stadium was it South Africans or Zimbabwe? Ah. Ah, uh, it's a mix. Ah, uh, it's a mix. It's a possibility. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Either way, it's possible. <laughs> It's possible. <laughs> hey! Ah, I a punk. I'm going to go to the I'm going to go to Did you guys know that seven means several? That seven means several? Yeah. Seven. Seven, yeah. No, eh? I didn't know. So I've got several. You, so we have several days in a week. Yeah. So like. No, man. I kid you I, not. I know where you're going. Right. It's that thing, you're seven colors. And then I went back correct, but now it's several colors. I've heard people say that thing and I find it so silly. No, it, does, it just doesn't work with several colors. You know, like, you you know, when you're talking about the food, right? Yeah, you see, it's a Sunday meals that we yeah. eat. Yeah, apparently seven means more than seven. So anything more than seven is several. So, like, couple means two, essentially. What what couple is yes, to two, yes. seven is to several yes, to seven. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Google fact check, it. Fact, fact check. check. Uh, fact check. check. That's why we have a fact check. Yes, we've been saying, <laughs> you know, we've been getting out with a lot of bullshit here. For real? Yeah, and people are like, hey, you guys have a fact checker. You're not using the fact checker. Like last time I said, Lud Love does the other show, and it's the other show with Tibo Touch. We didn't fact check it. Oh. Yeah. What does it say, fact checker? Um, there are many definitions of um, seven. seven in the dictionary, oh. but none of them mean what you're saying. Yeah. Okay, but then so Google okay. several. Yeah, what Please is Google? But what is the many? What is the many definitions? Um, I'm actually finding that that's a good one. Mm. Mm. There are many definitions a of a seven. What yes. is many? Mm. Okay, um, the many definitions of seven is firstly equivalent to the sum of three and four. That's the first one. Mm -hmm. A group of or unit. And then it also states that it can be, it can also be similar to septet, septuplets, and septenary, but not several. Then Google relationship of several to seven, or is several seven? Hmm. And then Mac will give us his source afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, give us your sauce. Name the sauce. Yes. Nigga pegging a sauce. Let's see. So you fool on the sauce. I'm pegging it. I'm pegging your sauce in the tire. It's all right. Did you Google it? I've heard people say several colors. I'm like, guy, man. Um, no. The, there isn't such. It actually says, by definition, several means three or more. That's what several oh. actually Couple is two for. or more. It was yes, two. two is couple. But several means a group of something that's three or more. That's when you use the word several. Who's your source? Uh, uh, Survivor. I was watching Survivor. Survivor? Yeah, so one of the contestants said... You still watch Survivor? Yeah, you always ask me that every yeah. time I say I watch Survivor. It's unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> You're not the only one. Like, you watch a Survivor. It's, it sounds like you still watch SABC 3. That's what it means. No, maybe, that's people still watch SABC. <laughs> I, I watch Survivor 3 and I heard wow. that guy. You heard that guy, yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah there was okay. a guy on the contest. One of the contestants, he said, seven is several. And then I was like, oh, I've never heard of that. And I Googled it and it said, yeah, several, seven is means several. But so you just, just got Googled Google now. <laughs> Using a different Google. 
Are you using Bing or something? <laughs> Remember Bing when you, Microsoft tried to have a Google and it was Bing. Are you using Bing or Yahoo? <laughs> Yahoo. Are you using Yahoo? When you make a way those people still Google. I'm, I'm a Yahoo boy. <laughs> ah, now, nah, boss. No, but if you use Google, then Google prove us now. I Come on fi- now. I, I can't find it where Google because it was nah. like late. It was late last night. Um, it's after in the, the history, shoot. fam. Yeah. Exactly. It's in the history. I'll he, find he, it he and you put it up in the, in the episode. Yeah, I'll find it. But I saw that. I was like, oh, that's interesting. But yeah. But they don't have a fact checker, man, on Survivor. So we've got a fact checker and I, I'd like to believe she, she yeah. she's correct. Yeah, I think let's just say she's correct until I can prove otherwise. <laughs> Okay, we'll come back to it. Yeah, we'll come back to it. <laughs> anyway, and now, Marimini, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Yes! Soliano is here, yes! Tibla is here, Ghost Lady is here, yes! Dudu's here, yes! Tato's here, Tibla's here, I mean, Shorts is here, yes! <laughs> Fat Checkers yes! here, Simpy is here. Oh, several of them. <laughs> Drop this fucking <laughs> I got uh, bad news and good news. What do you want me to start oh, with? Oh, start with the good news or bad Start with the bad news. Everybody's yeah, just start bad. With the bad start news. with the bad news. Yeah. Okay. Uh, bad news uh. is that... Um, I think I know. Remember, we've been trying to get the whole crew to come with us to USA. Oh. I knew it. That's something to do with that. Yeah, yeah. I knew it. And we wow. asked uh, Striped Horse. Shout out to Striped Horse. They came on board. They're going to give us some cash. Oh, nice. Shout out to Striped Horse. Shout out to Striped Horse. That's why we love Striped Horse. Horse. Yes, 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 yes. Milk Stout, Striped Horse. Yes, 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 yes. Shout, yes. Out. Shout out to Striped Horse. Yeah. But you know the US is expensive, so we needed more money. So we reached out to, 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 to Jack, Jack Daniels. Daniels. Jack Daniels. Hey, it's looking shaky, man. It's looked like it's not going to happen. Uh, Jack Daniels. Yeah, it looks like the deal is not going to go through, man. With Jack Daniels. Yeah, yeah. Because we sent them oh, a list yeah. of how much we need yeah. to bring the whole crew on board, you yeah. know? Because, like, we do everything with the crew. We're a yeah. team. Like, we do everything oh. together, whether we're on tour or whatever. So, with the U.S., we wanted the whole team to come on board. We sent them the budget of how much it would cost, and this is how much we need. And they were like, all right, cool. They'll think about it. But, yeah, no, it doesn't look like it's... Proposal cool. denied. Oh. Well... They haven't given us a definitive answer, but it's not looking good. Yeah. It's Jack Denials. It's... It's... I'm Kevin Sashela. Things don't happen. I'm out calling you Chalo. You know? But we need the power of the chillers, man. Because you know the power of the chillers is real, bro. Remember the, the last... Yeah. Remember the last episode I said, um, Betway, um... Uh, we're trying to get Betway to renew the contract with Onside, the soccer yes, podcast. Onside, yeah. Lennon, and, yeah, and Tepi, and uh, Marco, yeah. Marco, yeah. And, and then I said, please tag Betway and ask them to renew the contract. Yes. So we've got a meeting with Betway this afternoon. Ooh. After the power of the chillers. Nice. Wow. So I think we need the chillers, man, because okay. we need the whole team on this trip. Yeah, yeah, it'll be beautiful, man. No man left behind. It would be yeah. so sad to leave anyone behind. Bro. So like, please, chillers, dude. please tag at Jack Daniels and let them know that you would like them to sponsor the podcast you US tour. Oh. Just that. Oh. I mean, so good, so I'm a passport. Oh. <laughs> so good, so good. So good, I'm a family. So good, I'm a ex. What I'm a come to the pillar. In America. In Pakistan, America says, thank you. Yeah, thank you in Pakistan. Thank you on my luggage. I'm a sha. I'm a shabby link. I'm a shabby link. I'm a shabby link. I'm a shabby link. The Americans trick it. But if you can't see it, you can talk. I'm a shabby link. I'm a shabby link. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck man. So yeah. let's hold thumbs, man. Let's oh, all pray. Guys. Actually, should we pray? You know, yeah. prayer always works. Yeah, Fed Checker, give us a prayer there. You good with this, man? Yeah, please. Let's pray for this deal yeah. to go through, man. Let's pray for USA. Yeah, yeah. Close your eyes and bow your head. And <laughs> Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, we humbly come before you with our open hearts and open minds, asking and inviting you into this place. We ask that may you be with us and may you help us to successfully go to um, America, Lord. Your word says that whatever that we ask in your word, it shall happen, Lord. And today we come before you asking and we believe that we have received it. For your word also states that whatever that we've prayed for and believe in bargaining shall happen, Lord. And we do so and request so in your holy and mighty name. Amen. 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 We're going. We're going. We're going. We're going. We're going. We're going. If 
and I don't mean to be negative. <laughs> so, 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 I have a so, plan. Yes. yes. If it doesn't work out, <laughs> uh, some local South African artists, according to the manager of Marumba Pitch, got smuggled, so he says, the way he puts it, into the UK. They got scammed. So this guy booked them. And when they got to, to the UK, it was a mess. They had no accommodation. And then they went to the 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 the, 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 the to like try fly out early, went to the flight agency or flight airline, and the airline told them that you guys practically got smuggled into the UK. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so we can hit that promoter up, <laughs> you know, to make a plan for us. To smuggle us to, into to America. Smuggle us. To smuggle us in. To get us in. I found out so weird. It was a weird ass story. And it was quite a lot of them there. No. Went bro. to the UK. Yeah, yeah no, the, some of the UK promoters are not make sure, eh? For yeah. Yeah, but... chance takers. Because I heard the same story with um Musa Keys, if I'm not mistaken. When we're in the UK, remember? Musa Keys. When we're in the UK, remember? Yeah. One of the promoters told me that Musa Keys flew to the UK, yeah, but then he needed to go to a show in Glasgow. Yes, so they smuggled him into Glasgow, but at the border there in Glasgow, they turned him back because he didn't have the right papers. Yes. Yeah, so some Ouch. of these promoters are chance takers from, yeah, from the, the UK. Yeah, the guys got there, jiggy jiggy, they're driving around with the promoter's dad in like a bucky or whatever, mm. driving around. Then they got to some shady ass place, and the guys were like, "No, man, it's not make sure. Hey, where's our balance, even? Mm. You know?" And the balance was not forthcoming. And then the guys had to go to London, and then obviously they did the whole thing of trying to. You know, uh, check the the airline tickets, the booking reference if it checks out, and then that's where they found out that you guys actually have been smuggled. Mm. How did you guys get in this country? You know, because this reference is bogus. And uh, then they have got got some mates went to London, spend the night there, and then uh, they for no. somehow managed to get away of coming. Imagine back. they didn't have mates, bro. The, yeah, so yeah. they would have been stranded. Yeah, uh, they would have booked a hotel or something. Okay. I mean, yeah, they, they, I'm sure they could have yeah. afforded to book their own hotel. You know, as quite established artists after all. Yeah, so sometimes we see these artists all the way in like UK, Glasgow, Ireland, and stuff, Dublin, and we think you know, um, it's 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 all good. But some of the promoters out there are shady, man. Because mm, it's story. essentially just South Africans that side, you know. Also yeah. trying or some diaspora, like, not diaspora. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, from Their like luck. Zim, South Africa, Southern Africa, you'd find that side. Nigerian also, because piano is big that side. You know, the African diaspora. Yeah. It's just people, you know. So yeah. they'll always take their chances, some of them. Mm. Uh, on to more bad news. So remember we were meant to have a USA tour? Yes. Wait, wait, you said, oh, okay, you're still going to come with the good news. Yes, yes. Okay. Oh. So we're meant to have a USA tour. That has been now uh, postponed. Oh. Uh, we're going to have to reschedule it. Uh, so I apologize to all the American chillers. Uh, you will be refunded. And the reason being is because of the good news. Which is... Wait, so if... How? If we are asking Check to go to America, but we're have a tour, what are we doing in America? Listening is a skill. Let me cook. Yeah. Let me finish. I haven't I finished haven't, yet. I haven't, mis- I haven't not listened to you. I've been listening to you. Yeah. It's a valid question, no? Yeah, it's a valid question. No? Listen to some more. Okay. Are okay. you ready to listen? Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> but listening is a skill was a wrong response. <laughs> yeah. You know, I'm listening Because to you me. are not also breaking it down yes, properly. You're no, but he cut me off. He no. cut me off. I was speaking. I was at Baron and dance. Why? I was okay. getting to the good news and okay. then he cut me off. Okay. So as I was saying, mm-hmm. Penduka. So the reason why we have to reschedule the USA tour is because we are officially the media partner for the BT Awards. Oh, shit! Oh, <laughs> bitch! Shit! Whoa! Whoa! So we have to be <laughs> in LA the whole week. So that's why we can't go to the other states. Oh, remember, damn. we're meant to go to Atlanta, oh. uh, Texas, DMV, yeah. and all that. Yeah. So we're going to be in LA that whole entire week. Okay. So that's why we can't do all those what other states. What does it mean like, to be the, 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 the BT media partner? What does it Whoa. entail? Bro, we're there from like the beginning of the BT Awards uh, when end. it starts mm. until the end, until the ceremony. But I mean, like, yeah. Apart from that, do we have access to the, yeah. to the talent that we're gonna interview? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a skill, man. 
Ah, we're cooking, we're rocking, we're rocking. You cook so slow, you must be fast to think for me. Yeah, I'm going to cook the food. I'm going to cook the food. I'm going to cook the food. I'm going to cook seven colors for the whole day. Yeah, seven yeah. colors. Man, it's two hours to cook seven colors. Quick, man. quick. Or several in your case. Yeah. And it's so crazy. God works in mysterious ways because last year I was at... Um, Chisanyam, we're still doing Chisanyam. So 22nd of June, we're going to be at New Jersey. Okay, for... so we're not doing the tour. We're not podcasting, yeah. but we're doing Chisanyam because it's an event. Yes. It's not a podcast. Oh, you guys yes. are going to DJ. Yeah, we're yes, going to yes. play. And, yeah. yeah, yeah, on the it 22nd needs. of June. Yeah. So last year I was there at the Shisanyama event. Dope. And I wanted to go to the BT Awards, but I didn't have any access, didn't know anybody. I was just like, wow, fuck it. Bro. The DJ Spoon me is just gonna fast when I get there. Yes, 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 gonna yes, 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 yes. See yes. what happens. Yes. So I don't know, it's my first time in America. I'm in New Jersey and I get to the train station and I'm like, yo, can I have a flight to LA? And they're like, it's all fully booked because they've got, um, it's a big weekend that it's week. It's during July, like essentially. Yeah. It was the summers in Rustenburg. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then I tried to take a train and they said it would take like two days to get to, um, <laughs> <laughs> to LA. America's huge. So yeah. It's literally a whole continent if yeah. you look at it. Fast track, a year later, we're a media fucking partner. Yeah. Oh, we must that fucking is amazing. find those people at the fucking <laughs> airport and tell them shit. Like, yeah, motherfucker, I'm on the pay lot. Nice one, man. Yo, yeah, bro. man. Yo. How was the Kamsa show, bro? So sad. I couldn't make it because oh. we're in Rustenburg on Saturday and I thought I'd make the Sunday show. Yeah, yeah. But I ended up at Ghost Lady's house and we're just chilling, drinking. Oh, shame, man. That covers a show was beautiful. Is it? Wow. It was like magic heaven on earth. Is you know, it? the beauty. What I love about it is they stretched and took the music, you know, to its far limits. They weren't mm. afraid to move away from... The, the original compositions in a lot of aspects. Mm. So the beauty of it was you'd hear a song or you'd see Angelic come on stage, you know, to perform or to start in Anatula. Yeah. The remix, right? Or the remake. And you wouldn't know what song it is that is coming to perform because he also has got a with with exactly. up Until he goes, yay. Mm. And then the people lose it. Because we've been hearing the music, but they've broken it down so much. Gosh, you know what yeah. I mean? Like, to, to the point where only the lyrics when they come in, but it's still within the same key. So it mm. just sounds amazing. And then the familiar elements come back together. And then there's like these white guys, some comes with a trombone, like, whoa, whoa. Then there's a trumpet guy. Then it's like amazing. The saxophone guy has got solos. It was like orgasmic, mm. you know? It was like having an, a whole two hour orgasm, more than two hours, in fact, Ooh. nonstop, chills, goosebumps emotions it just it was a, a pure musical I saw that young Stan journey is, yeah, trip young Stan I mean yeah. he was in tears as he yeah. was performing because as you can hear I mean already young Stan's lyrics are just Very. captivating and then the emotional strings behind mm. it the instrumentation it was just brilliant man like and Gabs' catalog, man. Those are some songs that didn't perform. Like, I thought he would perform, for example, one of my favorite Gabs' songs is Tola. Uh, Nobu Uke, Young Stana. Oh, Tola. Hey, they didn't perform it. And that song's got strings and it's a big production, yeah. you know, just from Gabs' production alone. Didn't perform it on a couple of other songs. But Gabs' catalog, man, you gotta respect yeah. what he did, bro. And then there was a moment where Pori came. To perform um, Superman, uh, and then there was another performance when he was performing Isolo, and then he appeared like so. You expect him to see him on stage because uh, Dali Wong was like the last performer, and he fucking murdered it. And then Jiggy Jiggy Spotlight, boom! There he is by the boxes VIP, you know. And it's like oh, people lost it. It was just it was beautiful, man. Like guys were there, pop pops, Java. Everyone were there, wow. superstars were there, but they were all fans, you know? Even the guys who had performed, the Cosas and her daughter in them, they didn't just chill backstage. And this is the second night. Yeah. They also had to go and just witness the and magic. Watch. Because you felt like you were in a moment in history when that happened. And nobody deserves it more than Gabza, man. It was just you fucking just gave amazing. Me chills, bro. Shout out to the GOAT, oh. man. Shout out wow. to the yeah. GOAT. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Gabza's blessed, bro. Yeah. And Which, I think I was one of the first people to, to interview Gabza because it doesn't do a lot of interview so I got a moment to sit it was very short like 10 minutes but sit with them and just talk about music and I was so nervous man you know because you thought 
I'm pulling, you're pulling up, you know, like, I want to ask him all these things, you know, and it was just about music, because I'm also just fascinated to get into his head, just about his process, music, what it means to him, how he does his thing, and yeah, bro, it was beautiful, bro. Would you put it up, because uh, we've had some very historic events in the country, uh, you know, like Casper, uh, fill up, um, Black Coffee, filling up F&B Stadium type vibe, mm. would you put it up, up there? I would. Nah. I would. I, I I really genuinely would. Yeah, yeah. Um, obviously the venue wasn't as big, but the yeah. moment and for I'm a piano, bro, you know, this is such a young genre, bro. Like, and for it to have come this far, you know, it's a nod. And it's it's also like a wake-up call for just musicians, be it you're black, you're white, you're young, you're old. It is and also for young musicians to not be afraid to express themselves with the music because everybody wants to sound the same. Everybody wants to make the same sound. You know what I mean? And for Gabla to do that, you know, you could tell the mm. spirituality okay. in the music. And I remember asking him in the interview, I was like, which song is going to be the most difficult to translate into an orchestra or a symphony? And he said it's Adiwele because Adiwele doesn't have chords. You know, it's just like single notes, a bass note and that synth. Dun, 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 that's it. doesn't have like chords you know like multiple uh -huh. simultaneous notes and strings played. yeah it doesn't have and even if it does it's like one string you know what i mean and he said that and the way it translated so it's also like guys it can there's so many places you can go with with ama piano you know what i mean and and especially with the release because he dropped Gabs a chant just oh, yeah. before, you oh, know yeah. what I mean? Yes. Yeah, yeah, and shout out to him, shout out to Kelvin Momo. They bring that sound that we had championed. Well, I was one of the people who championed. Hey. 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 All right, listen to this, my mom. <laughs> <laughs> listen to the skin, boy. Skin. <laughs> oh, 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 okay. <laughs> what kind of piggy side? I get cold. I see piggy side. I literally championed myself, King Paya. Um, I, I was scared to came along with one more clip, but I had like uh -huh. the had, uh -huh. yeah, you know what I mean. I championed that sound. I've got like so many songs within that sound. So shout out Respect to soul. No, 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 no. Oh, people, think, people think guys, I want to, people really think I'm all about the puns and the talking and the radio and the broadcasting. I'm a serious music composer, man. You know, no, like for real. So. Shout That's out to why the guys. you find it hard to even just put your name on a song. Yes, you know, like just JNG, you know. I'm a serious, like, and for me, it's like, it takes a guy like a Kabza, a Kelvin Momo, because he also has Kurula, uh, which was, was mm. his first song in his Kurula albums, which also has that rhythm. For, and it takes guys like that to move the sound Forward, you forward, know, because yeah. when you come and you do it in your young producer, no matter how amazing the song is, people when they see a kabza, they will, they are open minded to it and they are open to the music to move them and touch them the way it ought to. So for me, it's a big moment in South African music, bro. Mm. Yeah, it's one of the big like moments, like milestone moments. Did kabza study music? No, 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 no. Wow. Not, not officially, like, yeah. not sense. technically officially. Most of the guys you know. that produced never studied um, music, can't even play the piano, some of them. Yeah, mm. some of them, yeah. yeah. It like, helps. Like, technically. To... Like, yeah. you know, like, how you're supposed to play the piano. And be able to read music. Yes, kind of vibes, yeah. yes. It's yeah. all just, like, it's actually crazy, eh? Wow. It's self-taught, a lot of them. A lot of them used to play in choirs, so, I mean, in, 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 in church. So they were taught by someone also, but it was, like, a, an, an, not, not a, a formal. Yeah. In, in an informal way a lot mm. of them were taught in an informal way obviously either by themselves or by someone in the hood who can play or within the family or yeah. the church yeah man you gotta watch I don't know if you checked out that I'm a piano reality show um, oh yeah with Angelic and um, yeah I watched uh, it Josiah and whatever Boy, my whole so, so, so yeah so on that one of the episodes uh, Angelic decides he wants to have a, a vocal coach mm -hmm. so he goes to RJ Benjamin Oh, gosh. You got to watch that scene. It's so funny. You just see Angelique going, Oh! Oh! Ah! <laughs> ah! Yeah. Hey. It's so funny. <laughs> For real. <Yeah. laughs> wait, but I'm curious, how did that go? Like, because Angelique is so raw, you know? Yeah, exactly. And RJ is a bit, like, refined. Yeah. Not a bit, very refined, you know? But it's also rugged. How did it go? Like, was, was it fruitful or did... RJ just go, hey man, you're special, just do you, you know? Because Angelic almost reminds me of a Zix Banduini, sort of. 
I think it's because um, he performs a lot. And if you check his songs, he's always like projecting a lot. So he just wanted to find a balance. So not to lose his voice or damage his voice. And I think it was just more of like filling up the episode more than like it being an actual thing. Aha, uh because -huh. I remember... Um, when we had, had Angelic on the show before and when you guys were walking out, I overheard him talk to you and there was a, a booking he had had or something. Or well, I think you wanted to book him. Yeah. Um, and he lost his voice. No, yeah. He said he avoids singing when he performs. Oh, taking, yeah, yeah. Singing bookings. He'd mm. rather DJ because it strains his, his voice, voice a yeah. lot. You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah. It takes a toll on, on his voice. What did you guys think of the new uh, Major League uh, song with the uh, Wiz, Wiz Khalifa? It's a vibe, man. I like it. It's a party it. jam. Yeah. It's gonna be a hit. I mean, yeah, it's it's it's, 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 it's a vibe. And also, I'm impressed. Wiz Khalifa Wiz really Khalifa. wrote. Mm. Yeah, he really wrote the beat. Yeah, like he floats. He just he floated, man, on the beat. I know I'm not the food. So mm. I loved it. Mm. I haven't heard the full song, but the snippet I saw. Did you hear the full song? Yeah, I, I saw the snippet. and I was impressed by it. You know, it's not thing new. It's new in the sense that it's got an American artist, but it, it's gonna be a hit song. You know, it's mm. gonna be a hit song, and then they'll have another hit in the next like. Obviously, whatever. shout out to the boys for pushing Piano. I mean, having oh, Wiz yeah. Khalifa on Piano is massive. That's yeah. historic. Yes, you know but for I mean? me, I was like, hey, sh I don't know. Is man. it similar to how when Ti jumped on a who's beat? Eh, yeah. You see, yes, you, yes, you know, and similar? now it's okay. forgettable. No one is like talking about. It. It's not yeah. like a super timeless song, but it's. It's like a great move, you know? For me, I had a cringe moment when Wiz Khalifa started talking about fucking your bitch and I'll fuck her all night and all day. On a piano song, for me, it's just like, hey, the vulgar stuff. We're over that. It's evolved. Remember when it started, it used to be like that. Mm -hmm. but, uh, yeah, but I think the sound has evolved that now it's more spiritual, you know? So to come on a spiritual beat or genre and just talk about fucking bitches all night and stuff like they do in hip hop for me was a bit like they talk like piano is like a gospel yeah bro <laughs> <laughs> wait explain so the we, spirit we, 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 from <laughs> bro I don't know man but when I listen to piano I go to another world bro yeah. like it makes me feel a certain type of way yeah. and during that moment to hear I fuck your bitch your hoe your bitch what what uh, it's a bit isn't, like isn't he, like isn't piano about expressing your truth and that's his, for yeah, example. Because yeah. he can't be like, what does a song talk about? And it's like, the song talks about, like piano generally will talk about like making it finally and getting out the hood. Yeah. But he's he's over that period of his life. So you're saying he's just about fucking bitches? Like he's not that's in that it? moment in his life. No, but that's more he said about that, obviously. But Mac is also talking about that particular part. But that's his, his lived experience. Like no. if reggae, for some, if it's if I do reggae, right, and the guys tell me what reggae speaks about a lot of times, and I don't relate to it, how can I then translate it into my reggae song? I don't think the onus is on him because he probably just likes the genre, is jumping on it. The onus is on Major League to tell them, hey, dude, like that's not how we move with piano. You know what I mean? Like change it here a bit or do this. You know what I mean? To kind of guide him. Maybe they were just starstruck. And how would that sound like? If they say, bro, piano, it'll, 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 let's say piano is spiritual and it's not entirely spiritual. No, 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 it's, it's not. I'm saying like, for example, if you listen to the Kamupela T.I. track, mm. T.I. really jumped on that and he didn't talk about fucking bitches or anything. He was just talking about I have a great time in Miami mm. by the beach and whatever. And it's like a party song, you know what I mean? So it didn't come off like very, uh, 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 you know what I mean? But it's art, bro. Yeah, I'm just, it's semantics, dog. It's yeah. just me being me, bro. Yeah, I feel like it's art, man. Like, either it's a hit or miss, and it can be a miss with him singing about bitches, and maybe not because he's singing about bitches, just because it's a miss. Mm. And it could be a hit with him also singing about bitches, and it's a hit. It's <laughs> <laughs> Remember that one? And that was a hit. Yeah, and that took you to hit places, eh? Yeah, that's what I'm a kid in the shirt cloth cloth. That's pretty trifling. Yeah, I know though, man. Come on. Oh, man. man. That's not real. Paris. Piano. Yeah, that was bubblegum music. Ah. Man. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. I thought you were a music connoisseur here. Get a top beat. Shine, come, ding. Spiritual! Oh, 
พึ่งกันกีแล้วเย็นะพึ่งกันกีโอ้พี่ไม่ได้ฟังค่ะยิมมี่เฮดออฟฟิศฟิศฟิศฟิศฟิศนึกเถอะเธอเธอนำมาลังกับบีเฮ้ยไปกลางอ่ะโอเคโอเคโอเคฮัลโหลก็รับไปดีกว่ารับไปกลางอ่ะเด็กสาวอะไรที่เกิดขึ้นอะไรที่เกิดขึ้นอัมบาอักมันบีนะสตรอว์พิลิสมาดาฟาค่ะโอเคเมื่อวันเสาร์นี้ที่ในสตูดิโอเดย์พิลิสมาดาฟาค่ะดาฟาค่ะดึงดึงดูดูอ่ะเฮ้ยฉันมีมาสปิริตชูเบกค่ะโอเคไอเอเน่ guys on just some sad news um she be shit So the news came out, and it was just after we had recorded on Saturday that he had an in, um, an accident. Remember, and he actually, well, a car accident, like his car got completely written off, and led to the death of his daughter. Had, I think he was also with his wife there, and yeah, it's just been very sad. Like um, he's in, still in hospital, in fact. I don't know how you guys. What do you guys feel? I know there was a whole uh, lot of debate. Man. Like people mustn't have no sympathy towards him because obviously someone said that. Someone yeah. said that. No, no. Oh, you know because Jeez. obviously it was. Yeah. You know reckless driving. behavior. You know and yeah. you know how he's how he moves. You This know, is what so. the story says. A uh, popular musician Shevishid's daughter passed away in a fatal accident on the R37 road <laughs> next to Smelter's Mine in Limpopo on Saturday night. The nine-year-old girl was traveling with the musician on his way to perform at an ANC Siangoba rally. Yeah. Celebration concert in uh, Lebua Home. There were three passengers in Shebeshit's Volkswagen Polo when the vehicle collided with a truck and overturned. Mm. Yeah. Jeez, I found out when I was playing. While I was playing, that's yeah. when the news broke. When I just at, uh, at, at Northwest. Yeah, because you played after me, right? Yeah, yeah. At Vogue Lounge. Yeah. Uh, Bala, I see, all came and he showed me oh. Musa Kaula's tweet, which was. Oh, shout accurate. out to, we finally saw my soul, eh? Oh, yeah. Oh, my soul, my soul. Hey, finally Brad. met my soul. Bra, bra, So did you guys talk to him? Yeah, yeah we sure. did. Oh. had a chat with him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What did he say, man? It was like, soul, meet my soul. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I'm like, Ish, the wrong soul, man. Yeah. I'm like, hey, this other one is the one. Yeah. Yeah. Uche, you guys spoke at length. No, I told him, I'm like, yo, dude, we just finished shooting the podcast in Northwest. We really wanted you because you're like the fucking mayor of, of Rastan. Yeah, man, yeah, you, know? you run. He's like, ah, oh, you should have called me. I would have come through. I was like, no. Oh, ah, man. that's that I'm like, how? Thing. Dudu called you, though. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. That's an industry thing of Oaks always saying, I'm going to come when you meet them. But then when the call is made, uh, the, the team or them, they're like, No, 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 no! Yeah. Don't do it! Mm. Don't do it! Jeez, but that guy moves like a <gasps> fucking president. <gasps> yeah, bro, it was like <laughs> security detail about uh, about valley guns and stuff, bro. That's crazy, man. Yeah. The What did you say to him? him crazy. Oh no, great meeting you. I forgot. I was drunk, man. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I forgot. Really, I was drunk. I'm like, hey, man, great meeting you, bro. Cool, because I don't know much about him. That. He's a baller. He owns a mine or mines and businesses that side. Yeah. But I pretty much don't know much about him. But I was like, "Yo, man, shout out, great meeting you, man. He's cool, yeah, cool, nice one, man. Sol, 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 yeah, sol, sol, sol." That's <laughs> it. the Spiderman thing, you know. Like. <laughs> so what what does Butter say to you? Uh, he comes and he shows me uh, a screenshot or a tweet by Musa Kaura that Shebe has passed on after mm. a tragic car accident. And I'm like, oh my gosh, he's in another accident. This happened. Then I start obviously searching, getting on Twitter, Googling, and it says, no, he's 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 injured. And then only later I, I see that he lost his daughter. Bro. I'm like, yo, it's a death of a child, bro, you know? Everything else, say, boy, now everybody's gonna say, yeah, about this, but oh man, it's a death of a child. And here's the thing: I no, I can't imagine what it's like to lose a child. Yeah. Um, and I can't imagine what it's like to lose a child. And then you probably will, because the world already blames you for it. Exactly. And you will blame yourself for it, because you, in your heart of heart, know the truth. Even if, let's say, I'm sober and I'm driving, I have a car accident, and my daughter dies, mm. for example, God forbid, touch wood. Um, I, 
I will still blame myself as sober as I am. Yeah. It wasn't my fault. I was the one driving. Maybe a car comes into my lane. I'm still going to blame myself for it. I could have done this. I could have done that. Now, it's even worse if, you know, I was being reckless. So you can imagine the kind of, of, of trauma, bro. It's you, you can't imagine it, you know? And did he lose something happened to his leg or something I'm hearing there's been it's yeah, not confirmed. rumors yeah. it's, it's not confirmed, confirmed. It's not confirmed. but about his leg being amputated I don't can know. you check yeah. that fact check yeah yeah According to News 24, um, yes, it has been fractured and he's still in hospital. He was unconscious. But it doesn't state exactly to what extent are the injuries. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think, and I don't think now's the time, man. Yeah, you know, for people exactly. like, yeah, he's reckless. He's always been reckless. We saw him outside propaganda, speeding up and down. Or he's from Lumpopo. You should yeah. know the R37 is dangerous. Spiro, you know the R37 very well. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah, we're crashed into cows there. So it's that mm -hmm. kind of road, you know what yeah. I mean? But I'm hearing those talks. Reckless is, be, you know, you're speeding, all these things. Now is not the time for that, man. A, ch a parent lost a child. Exactly. You know, regardless, a child that he loved. Yep. You know what I mean? Uh, be it the case that what happened happened, how it happened, yeah. he still loved his child with all his heart. People that know him and that follow him on social media were like, it's like people who watch the podcast know how Mac feels about his kids, how yeah. I feel, and everybody feels about the kids, you know? And people who knew him were like, knew that, that guy. So at the end of the day, he's a, a parent who's lost a child. Everything else, so he's born now. And I think he should be given time and space, you know? But it's, it's horrible, man. A child died, bro. You know, it's, it's sad, bro. Yeah, for checker. No, I just wanted to add on that they stated that the accident was caused by him colliding into a heavy motor vehicle. Yeah, a truck. So it caused the car to overturn. Ish. God. Oof. Yeah, man, that was, yeah, that was like, yes. yes. Yeah, let's just pr exercise, you know, sensitivity in Ubuntu, man. It's not the time now to ask all these things and say. Yes, that's what people were saying. Yeah, why is the child fun, sitting in front? Man. Why is the child sitting in front? Because there's a video of him and the child, and I don't know. Yeah, I couldn't see that video. I heard yeah, his no, graphic. Also, I don't also don't. No, no, no. There's a video. There's a graphic video of him on the on laying on the ground, and I'm not sure if the child is shown, but the, the, a video that shows the ground and and him on the ground, and there's another video I think he was recording while in the car. I don't know if it was from that night, but Ish. it looks like it was, you know, showing the speedometer, the child sitting, you know, and yeah, man. Um, you know, his life will never be the same. Oh yeah. no 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 not at all! It won't be, bro. Not at all, man. It's. Do you think you're gonna no see a different Shibi Shift after this? Or eh? like once he's recovered, you know, will he move start moving differently? Like we'll not we'll see a different. I think we might. Mm. I think we might with a with most people you would, you yeah. know. Either we won't see him at all. Mm. Either it's just gonna be like, man. Let me, you know what I mean? But definitely it changes you, you know? Yeah. I know it was his only child, but if God blesses him with other kids, for example, I think, you know, he'll do things differently. Yeah. You know, if he could definitely have that opportunity again, he would do things mm. differently, you know? So definitely that kind of trauma changes everyone for good. Definitely. Anyone. What else you got, Ghost Lady? Wasn't someone cheating on someone or Ooh. like, what's, what's going on? Who cheated so now? Oh, no, wait for the story. Television actress and singer Latoya McKenna. Oh, someone cheated, Vel. Yeah. I was just saying that, like, because, you know, every weekend celebrities are cheating. Yeah, Conan's here. <laughs> yeah. Conan's here, some good. Ba okay, no, no, this is even worse. Ba no there's, 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 there's physical assault in this story, okay? Yo. Yo. So, um, Latoya has allegedly scalded her spouse, um, Ulebo Hang Pumulo, Pulumo. Who's eh, Latoya? Hmm? Who's Latoya? Latoya, an actress. Latoya McKenna. McKenna. Blonde. Blonde, yes. She was on Generations even. Google her. With the dreadlocks. Latoya, yeah, what? You know Latoya McKenna, McKenna. man. McKenna. Latoya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know Latoya McKenna, bro. Latoya McKenna. Oh, yeah. Generation. I know Latoya. Yes, 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 you know, yes, yes, from... Um, yes. Whoa, this story is about her. Yes. Damn, okay. Yeah, What's going um, on? What happened her, there? Sp her spouse. She was uh, married to Lebo Hang. You know, her Lebo Hang. Yeah, it's in the same sex relationship, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, so she scalded her with boiling water mm -hmm. um, and also um, used an ice, hit her with an ironing board and threw a vase at her before damaging furniture and burning down the curtains of their Ranfortin marital home. 
So that's where the issue is right and now. And then what's and house? I think they are completely like just it's the, the this the, this is the end of their relationship because we've had the back and forth. Remember, some points they had there's some allegations. They she had to report to I don't know who one another in the police station. They were in Randburg or was it Mid Rand? Mm. They've they've always been on the news for literally kind of like assaulting each other. You know. So Physically. what does this have to do about cheating? Who cheated here? Um, appar- well, apparently she was cheating with um, a Nigerian drug like uh, dealer. Latoya. So married, yes. Wait, wait, wait. Latoya is cheating, yet she throws, throws water. water, boiling water. No, at this, her this was probably in her, they were wife. having an altercation. So these incidents occurred on three separate occasions in the past three years. Oh, okay. McKenna has also slept with a married Nigerian drug merchant behind Keso's bag in exchange for narcotics. Eva. For drugs! Uh, Allegedly. So this is, yeah. This would have done well in generations. This is a nice script. This is why I say that. Yeah, they gave her the wrong one. (laughs) (laughs) But that is crazy. That's traumatic, bro. Damn. Over the years, there's always going to, there was always stories that will pop up about them, about something that she. So she's on drugs? Hey, allegedly. So is this GBV now? Yeah. No, man, but isn't uh, but her wife has got money, bro. I know that she's like an executive well, or something. It doesn't. It's like saying uh, someone they work is, uh, that doesn't excuse you whether you've got money or no money. No, but imagine, let's say you are on drugs, right? And like Naga's got money. Okay. Right. You don't need to explain why you have you are, you are, you are withdrawing money from the account or why what you're gonna do with the money that it gives you, right? But the issue so is why would you go out and explaining. sleep with someone for drugs? So clearly, like, maybe they, the, uh, the, it's like with like a drug-free marriage, and therefore now she ended up sleeping with someone else. She's hiding her drug addiction, maybe. Maybe. Yo. So when you're hiding, so you go out instead of use family funds. You understand? Fair check. Maybe that's In the court of law, is this GBV? Where we at? Do, do yeah, you? yeah, 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 yeah. Good question, bro. Is this GB, GBV? Because... Like, um, I'm I'm reading an article that was released um, by a law site in 2005 that's called Jester, and apparently it is seen as gender-based violence in lesbian and gay experiences. Mm, mm, mm. She cancelled Not yet. just like domestic violence, guys. She's not cancelled yet. Because... She's it was still... a case. I'm so not that, that sure mean... if it's a South Sorry. African case or an American case, but from what it looks like, it might seem like it was an American case. But it does stay. Yeah, that's different law altogether. Mm. Yeah. But it's still assault, man. It's domestic violence, number one, which is fucked up. You so know, if we, you beat each other up... We don't hit, hit our wives. You and Mac. We like don't you burn and... our wives, boil, pour them with boiling water. So could you still charge for GPV? GPV is not a charge, necessarily. Assault is the charge. And it's assault. No, but I'm just saying, is this okay? Are you, are you can you still grade it as GPV then? If what? If you, it's just two men are fighting. No. If Saul hits me. Yeah. Oh, uh, that's assault. That's assault, man. <laughs> Have you seen a big Saul? With an S O L T, assault. <laughs> no, shall I hear me? Assault. Assault. No, no, I'm saying because of in the same sex, like um, uh, really? a relationship, mm-hmm. if it's still, it's labeled because this is assault both ways, right? So there were, it's, it's, it's been just messy both ways. Yeah, but I hope you know we're just highlighting how fucked up it is. That hey, man, yeah. Because she's a lady, nothing yeah, has happened. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, man. Like... But, yeah, but not, maybe... Because, for example, Mac, if me not say sad or say I'm not going to get cancelled, you know? And I'm assuming I win, obviously. Because <laughs> <laughs> I think the basis is... You, you're a man, you can defend yourself. Mm. yourself. Gotcha. The powers, the strengths are equal. Yeah. Gotcha. So La, they probably, I mean, she, you know, whether she'll get cancelled or I don't know. But it'll be like, you're not attacking the other one because based on their the, the, the sex oh. and that they are weaker. They are weaker, yes. Oh, I see, yes. Yeah, I see. So, so okay. it's like, okay. it's like, 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 it's Umparati will come for me. Yeah. Even if wrong still. Yeah. Because I can't because I was with defense. Ah, and you, and I'm you. hitting him and i I feel confident to hit him mm. based on the fact that yes. that's why most of the oaks who hit the wives don't even fight other men. Exactly. Mm. Some of them. Yeah. You know, mm. so I think maybe that's why I the society you. won't look at, at the lens of 
you are taking advantage then maybe of a man. We must just oh. remove the effects on trying using GBV. It must be there. But it's still attack. domestic yeah, violence it's and it's fucked violence. up. Exactly. It's fucked up, man. Exactly, exactly. Mm. Fucked up. Oh, man. The checker? According to a book or article that was written by Ivanshi Naidu and Nontantlam Kize, they do state that in South Africa, um, gender-based violence between gays and lesbian is actually seen as domestic violence. However, it does Good. not take away the fact that there is a certain position of rule that is being played within it. Yeah. However, according to law, they are seen as equals, so it will be cons um concluded as domestic violence. Yeah. Mm. Okay. 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 Hey, man. Damn, wild story, man. And nothing has changed since, because this came out on Sunday, ne? Mm. Nothing has changed. No update on the story. I got to say, I'm a chachi, so moon, yeah. Nothing, any developments on the story? According to Times Live, um, Latoya has officially stated on social media that she has separated yeah. completely with her. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, sounds toxic. There. Sounds like they should have done it ages ago because they've been going yeah. through. Sometimes, guys, I'm not really sure. been hearing these stories. Mm. Yeah. And I always believe it's that small. Like, if you see that this is already brewing, uh -uh, then just. Well, it's not brews with them, but. Uh, Sold, sold, sold. I was chatting to uh, Greg Jabesi. You know Greg Jabesi? Yes. Jabesi, yeah. great BTC. Yeah, he used to do the Bitcoin segment. Yeah, there. Mm. yeah. So he's in San Francisco, uh, San Francisco at the moment. Mm. And he was showing me like they have Ubers that are driven by AI. So there's no human in the car. You sit in the back and they drive you to wherever you want to go. Great. What? <laughs> And this, oh, I'm gonna do a You're like, driver, send me to this fucking like, send literally, you know what I mean? Like, send me to my destination. I've told you about this yes, though before, yes, guys. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Or, or, sometimes in Milo Menugai, or sometimes I'm a co-op and Nugai, or it takes away all of that human interference. Sadly. But bro, it takes away jobs. Oh fuck. <laughs> hey, but it's a job also, Kara no Munto knew you said. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> hey, are you guys not worried about AI, bro? Yeah. Hey, I'm starting to get worried fourth now. Yeah, yeah they fourth got industrial, Ubers. bro. Fourth Damn. industrial revolution, bro. So, so can you just imagine in three years' time what's going to happen? What jobs do you think are on the line now? Oh, man. Hey, can you imagine? Podcasters, AI can do these things. They've already started, bro. Already like, started. if you go on uh, social media, mm. you can see so many fake videos of, like, Ronaldo saying something when it's not him. Yeah. They, they, they do the AI thing and then they put a video of him but you don't see his lips moving mm. but he's talking you know and he's saying some fake news but you see there are, all, there are some jobs bro that I feel are functional right and driving an Uber great job it helps all of us makes life easier for us makes life easier you know for not driving someone back to their house at 3am in the morning you know what I mean but it's just for the sake of driving and then there's some jobs where, personally, me, I can't get entertained by something that I know isn't like from me. There won't be that like thing of fuck. Mac is good at this. How does he do it? You know what I mean? Because I know it's AI. It's perfect. It's supposed to do that. Unless I want AI, an AI voice to inform me of news, right? That's just gonna read news in the morning. That's functional. But there's some crafts that are just so artistic and they leave that thing of how do they do it? Like, you know what I mean? Like, fuck, how does it come up with that on the spot, for example, yeah? But then there's some jobs where it's like, there's no soul to them. You just need to drive from here to there. And not to say those people don't deserve their work, but I won't fully appreciate AI. That's why as a kid, I never liked games. Like I don't play games, PlayStation and stuff, because to me it's like it's programmed. It's like, you know, it's like, <laughs> wow. There is, there is, <laughs> To me, yeah, for real. It's like there's permutations <laughs> for everything. So the guy who programmed that had like 20 permutations, for example. If I press this, I press that. And then if this leads to that, there's always like this finite outcomes to a game. Mm. There's only like maybe a thousand permutations if it's a really good game, but yeah. it's always like pre-programmed by somebody out there. And I, I've always found that like, nah. That me. time I've been thinking about buying a gaming PC. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 nothing wrong with that. But for me, 
feeling uh, I'll tell them like, So ah, said man. no <laughs> No it's the same reason I can't watch Generally I don't watch movies twice because, And I know people who can So it's just for you It's for you Some people can watch the movie 10 times mm. Knowing what they're gonna say In the yeah. next line I just can't personally And so There's certain things I could never watch The AI podcast Come to think of it mm. You know Cause it's like Okay, you're fetching that information that was fed into the program. Which you was can trained, also find. Was which trained. Was, which you could also find. Yes. Yeah. And it's going to put, you know, it's in such a way. And it's like, okay, cool. Whereas the my... human mind evolves. So it's like you are just stuck on that specific time when one had this certain opinion of that. I don't know if you understand. No, I get that. Yeah. And, and I agree with you guys. My thing is when this AI thing started, when we spoke about it, yeah. it started with chat GPT. At no point did I envision one day we'd be talking about a car that can drive you. It's not, bro. You understand? Yeah. So I'm it's thinking nuts. in three years' time, what does AI look like? That mm. that's that's what I'm trying to figure like out. If you no can longer see like maybe it's um like your cashiers when you go to the supermarket. There we go. That's, that's one job yeah. that I think will literally you'll be cashing out for yourself. Like Ish. maybe you just get there with your basket, everything Crazy. is just scanned, hey, jobs, you just pay. Man. You go out, you know. Because already in Dubai, they're doing this thing where, um, like, you don't carry a passport. Your face is a passport. Have I spoken about that? Mm -mm. Yeah, so your face is a passport. So you can just travel to the world. Obviously, when you're in SA, you'll apply for your visa. Uh, no visa. It's a visa. Like, yeah, paperless visa. You'll apply for your visa. You see, you follow the same process. But when you get there, you walk through, like, this red tunnel. Please search that system. You walk through this red tunnel, little scan, you know. And then the AI is sort of, like, picks up your 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 face as your 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 your, your 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 unique your features etc you know and they'll be like oh yeah this person's passport is 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 uh, approved and valid they're in the country legally you don't carry a visa rather yeah through ai bro like wow. yeah. no, last time and, oh, from, last time nice. i was in dubai uh, um, our food was getting delivered by robot Oh yeah. So you order and then the robot brings the food. Yeah. For real? Yeah. yeah. Dubai's wild. Jeez, are you serious? Yeah. yeah. The like, waitress. Uh, so yeah. there goes the waitress, but then that's good, man, because you know they they're weird when you don't tip them, especially if they're chillers. Jeez, bro. <laughs> hey, the, these robots. You know, like eh, here's your beer. <laughs> Jazzy released the statement. Like <laughs> 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 a robot. Thank you. <laughs> Nah, it's my dude, man. It's just, it's just jokes. Come on. Ah, stop tormenting robots. Yeah. Nah, man, I love them. Yeah. I love robots. Bro, is that thing still big? Like everywhere I go, everyone's talking about dude, that. Dude, and, and when we had that, I didn't think it was going to be such a yeah, big thing. Yeah, exactly. The thing is, maybe like he chose the yeah, wrong word. You're trying to cancel him, like yo. Because he could have easily just said what happened if he like, saw, guys, but also on. now I heard that it's in court. Jeez. You could have just said it's in court. Yeah. It's, it's in court, guys. You know. It's in court. There's a court case. There's a court thing happening. Yeah, but you must Some check out. You must check out the latest episode of Popcorn and Cheese. Addressed it. Does he? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh shit! What did he say? Uh, something. Watch. Watch the episode. Oh. Okay. They need the views there. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> oh, am I lying? It's a fact. I haven't seen it, man. Oh, like I want to check it out. You guys man. make me sound like um. It's a fact. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure release the statement. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Deal. <laughs> yes, Ben Check. <laughs> um, before I go to um Saul's statement, um, yes, there is actually self-driving cars in Phoenix, in America, and in China as well. Tokyo and in Japan. Mm. So they were released in 2023 Tokyo in October. They were created by Uber and Waymo, which is Waymo, that's what the name of the car is called. Yeah. And it is also hand in hand with Google. So currently what they mostly do is Uber Foods and delivery. But some of them are transporting human beings, even though Crazy. it's mm -hmm. not really fully um, placed into impl implementation. Yeah. And then in terms of Dubai... Um, Dubai also did launch their um, face recognition biopic, um, biometric ID in 19 September 2023. So the whole idea is for you to be able to use transportation like catching flights or a train without necessarily needing your ID. You or just passport, walk, visa. yeah, or a passport. You just walk through and it will scan your face Tunnel. and already see. Mm. Right. Rumba Pitch needs that, you know. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> At least they wouldn't have wasted their time. You know, they're not actually seeing it fast. 
But uh, you know where I also see this thing about AI well, like yes, being yeah. used and like a lot of it banks. If you notice, mm. a lot of the time in the banks, you don't even get tellers. You have to go do, if you have to deposit money, you use the ATM outside. Those, it's it's just a lot of changes. If you've noticed like banks specifically. No, the bank is the ticketing thing. That's the only thing I've noticed that's different. Not only, but the, it's, you get to, for instance, if you go to, um, like I use F&B, for yes. instance. When you go there, then they'll still tell you, no, just go sit in the phone, like go consult. You have to consult and you're the, 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 the consultant. And you, like, you go to the bank, but to sit on, to get oh, give yeah. the phone and yeah. And you talk to and someone, you talk oh, to yeah, someone yeah, yeah, yeah. who's sitting at home. Yes, yes, And yes, it's like, yes, how, yes. why? Or maybe there's a And the branches are getting office. smaller. The branches you see? are getting smaller. Yeah, smaller, yeah. less humans, eh? Mm, yeah. Or even like if you, there is interaction, you sit with the consultant, they'll still put you on a call. Like, okay, well, let's make a call to this department. And you're like, and you can't you help me? No, I'm only limited. So you can see that a lot of changes. It's just like banks can be a nightmare, especially if you need like physical like assistance. Where it still goes back to you have to speak to someone on the line. It can be frustrating. Like then you can jump down from one line to another. Like yeah, but that is a whole world of AI. The world is changing, man. Yo. Shout out to Bafana Bafana. Bro, after the Epcon, I think I'm starting to fall in love with my friend, my friend again. Of These boys are so. playing, yeah, eh? Yeah, man, they are, bro. But they uh, filled up. Okay, so <laughs> the question is, the filling up of the stadium, was it South Africans or Zimbabwe? Ah. Yeah. Uh, it's a mix. Uh, it's a mix. <laughs> it's a possibility. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Either way, it's possible. It's possible. <laughs> hey. How long did it take you to think of that one? Yeah. <laughs> Did you she's read it moving. somewhere? She's <laughs> moving, she's moving in the seat with so much pride. <laughs> I wish you could see her, man. Like, ah. That's a good one. <laughs> yeah, hey, we never know, eh? We we'll yeah. never know. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, but we can't take away, you know, blooms, like, bloom people have, like, your support. Yeah. Especially we'd see with the Celtics, remember? Mm. Like, for soccer. So, like, guys, uh, let's not take, I'm not just, just asking. Shout out to Bafana, yeah. man. Bafana, Bafana did what? I saw a tweet. I don't know if this is true. Lesotho hosts their, their games in, in the country. In SA? At Moses Mapira, yeah. I wouldn't be shocked about that. Why is that so? Hi, but it's a whole sovereign country. Ah, come on. Lesotho is another province of SA. Uh, yeah, don't disrespect Lesotho. So don't have like FIFA qualifying stadiums because obviously it's a FIFA tournament so they need to meet, clearly, mm. need to meet a criteria I'm not sure for their stadiums. That. No, stadiums, yeah. FIFA needs accredited, approved stadiums. You can't mm. just play them around you know, and be like... <laughs> Let's do two versus Benny. <laughs> eh, hey, I'm a crowdie. You know what I mean? Like, it needs to be... No, not this thing, but if they... Yeah, and I love... We love this. We think we're going to love, but... Hey, I'm in the stadiums. It's like... Or like qualifying stadiums. Maybe they Please don't. check where the Lesotho game was held, the, F F um, the World Cup qualifier. I think what is in Moses Mapida. According... Okay, there isn't any other source that is covering this except for Times Live. And they do state that yes, Lesotho was um, was playing against Berlin in South Africa. Hey! But they don't exactly state exactly what was the reason for them being in South Africa. And because it's Times Live and no other source, I don't know how how concrete or how true it is. No, no, Times Live. I mean, it's, yeah, it's just okay. a confirmation of a venue. I don't think they'll lie about yeah. the confirmation of a football But are venue. they obligated to play, like, if you it's the country, you have to play with your country. Is that an obligation? Unless there's war. Unless there's war, unrest. You can have your games elsewhere. I remember okay. when Egypt was going through stuff as well. They, at some point, they didn't play their games in Egypt when there was, like, unrest. Remember okay. that? Okay, yeah. That revolution, Arab oh, Spring. yes, yes, yeah. yeah. The, 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 the unrest there. So, yeah, unless there's war, unrest, and then if you don't have stadiums that meet the criteria, which need upgrading to, you know, for security reasons, then I'm assuming you can ask a country to say, Rikadiming stadium. Rikadiming stadium. Ah, bro, did you realize you forgot to ask uh, people in Rustenburg, do you lick it? Oh. What an own goal. We're going to have to go back now. <laughs> Yeah. yeah! Any excuse to go back? Any Let's excuse. go ask them. Ask Let's go glow in the dark. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Uh, something that I saw that which I really like, yeah. right? 
three fans, soccer fans in Spain got arrested for racially abusing uh, Vinic- Vinicius Jr. Oh, finally. Eight months. Good. And they're banned from the stadium for two years. Good. Finally. Good. How beautiful. Good. 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 Now, this thing has been nice. happening in Italy and Spain. Yeah, yeah. Because in England, it's a thing. You yeah, know, yeah, you don't yeah. just do that now. Finally. England bro. is the press. <laughs> yes. Yeah, the press are fucked up. Jeez, bro. Own. And it's subtle. Yeah. It's subtle, yeah. but you pick it up. If you know, always, you know. Yeah. yeah, if you know, you know. It's yeah. like when they win. Harry Kane is front page. Yes. The boys, three, three lions. Yes, yes. Defeated. Uh, well done. If they lose, it's two black guys, Bakayo Saka, <laughs> the face. <laughs> no, for real. Yeah. Oh, no, no. And he played so 15 fast. minutes. Yes. It literally happened this past weekend. Yeah. They lost. Yes. Bakayo Saka came in, played 15 minutes. But uh, the headline was, three lions are trash, whatever. And they put uh, Saka's picture. Not Foden. Mm. Not uh, a- a- anybody else. Not... Uh, 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 Sis, fucking Grealish? Mm. No. Not Declan Rice? No. Bokayo Saka. Mm. Yeah, no. Sucks, bro, to be black. Nah, that's not nice. I'll send the segment to Betway. That was a good segment about soccer. We did like five minutes in soccer. <laughs> Stand it, boy. Uh, peace chop it up. I need this afternoon. Man, <laughs> <I'm telling> <laughs> <laughs> we need everything. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Ghost Lady, any last thing you want to talk about? Guys, your boy Angelic. Ah, Angelic. Angelic. Fonelli. Ah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Ah, I'm going to some fair time. I'm going to need some Ah, it's no one important, Chief. Hmm? It's no one important. Oh, yeah. Mm. So there was a post. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, don't make it look like it's something that it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Who He's is it? A lot, but not saying a lot. Boy, no, boy, it's a number, bro. It's not important. It's a, it's probably my god or something. You don't save your god number. Your god ah, is bro. not important. Like ah, this is the show is more important than me answering my god now, guys. Okay. <laughs> ah, let's call him. I wanna de- debunk this thing. Now it looks like hey. <laughs> like who who is it? Yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. Let's just call him and you'll talk to him so. Since he started it. How bad? If you got around, you actually for not come ring. Hey, you actually got that's not important. Where I go for you, I go for you. You're not important. Go for you, go for you, go for What song? Go for you. You know, come on, what song is that? Come on, come on, How do you come up with the word for no come on? You know what I mean? Go for you or whatever that thing. Chocolates. <laughs> Wait, you went from Hello? Eda? Hey, pardon me. You don't say game, man. I'm the owner, man. Do you want to miss call? Yeah, man. Uh, I'm here uh, at. Um, yeah, uh, all right, okay. No worries. Sharp. <laughs> oh! Sharp. <laughs> Ah, it's fine. It's okay. It's the guy. 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 Hey, ghost lady. Yeah. So the post we saw a post from Umusa Kaula, right? Um, put up on Twitter said Angelic's girlfriend Noktula Manonga kicks him out of her apartment. According to Noktula, she and her boyfriend Angelic got into a heated argument, and since she owns the apartment, she had no choice but to kick him out, which I feel is fair. Yeah. Now, are you feeling bad for your yeah. boy? Is that why you didn't come yesterday? I don't know. Hey, Dudu. What happened? Did you speak to Angelic yesterday? Yeah, because remember last time you said it's going to come and it was supposed to be yesterday. Mm. So that time he showed me when he was there with the gown, was he at the girlfriend's place? Hey. Asas. Mm. Yeah, no. uh, goes, uh, but it's not like he's homeless. <sighs> yeah. Um, so it, yeah. When he's swimming pool, food to call, no right, Angelic, man. It's not like he's now... F- Fame, f- like homeless. Yeah, so I called him yesterday while we were shooting the, the dating show. Actually, he picked up and then he said, I now knock to Lala, pull my window. That's literally what he said. And then when I tried to ask something else, he hung up. And when I called him back, he didn't pick up. <laughs> he said that honestly. Pull my window, I never moto. He just said, "Now, I'm loud, no tool. Now, pull my window." Shame, man. Know. Yeah, I don't know. So it's trouble in paradise, or just one of those couple fights. 
I saw us, boy. Hey? Mm. I, I never, us, I never but... want a luck to take things lightly. You know, whatever. No matter how minor, if it's like it's get help mm. or decide to go to high hair. I'm going to lose on it. And maybe this is not your kind of your behavior, but please explain to me. Women who break shit, yeah. right? Yeah. So maybe the guy's got a nice car, you caught him cheating, or you have problems. Why do you go for the car and scratch it, destroy it, smash windows? Or if I've seen a, 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 a pic on like making the rounds where Mfaz pull it TV, tell him I'm a it, and I'm a fish oily, and I'm a panda. What's up with that, man? Like, why do you come for people's items? No, no. So it's 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 like a tantrum, for instance. You see, like a kid when you're frustrated, and maybe the kid decides to throw away his or her toys. You understand? So same thing, like. You are frustrated. You want to release the anger. This person has hurt you. You know, so, hitting him, well, the guy will retaliate. Actually, we understand. So maybe then it's the thing of, like, I'm just going to hit everything else. So, like, the it's kid, the why release. don't you break your possessions, your toys? Never seen a kid smash a TV because they're angry, ain't you? Know? Yeah, some They'll kids do. Smash... <laughs> Oh, you're, you're yeah, shy. Kids well, are crazy you know, like that. Well, <laughs> a big crazy kids like Yeah, like that. I don't like that. Women, man, you guys, you know, like how? Okay, skabene, why am I going to move? Especially like in your like your Zame, like your out, and Shale Rumini, maybe my most prized possession, but, it's um, my TV, and the poor easy. But at that, point, you break my at that point, it's inch. like I'm trying to retaliate. Like just also. Should I call him Jenji? But why break my things, my personal things? Let's Should call him Jenji. Uh, but... Call him Jenji, boy. Because he hasn't released a statement, ne? Yeah? yeah? No, no, he hasn't, has he? No, no, he hasn't, he hasn't. Yeah, let's call him. Oh, man. You know, like, I'm not going to pull this in. I'm not going to pull this in. I'm not going to pull this in. Okay, you're going to pull this in. You're going to pull this in. Exactly, you're going to pull this in. Oh, so I'm not going to pull this in. No, it's just going to hurt you. It's like I'm hurting you back. I'm not going to pull this in. 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 I'm not going it's a request. Yeah, I make. It'll drop me off again. Oh, <laughs> exactly. Oh, so easy, guys. And then Sabuela, na manje milling lung si moto steel. Yeah. Nah, man, that's petty. Stop it, man. Yeah, that's but like also it's it's it's, it's also deal with the cause. What causes that behavior, and then also stop. So let it be the stop of let us not just stop it. Cause we can't focus on the effect. What's the cause? So, Book cheese. Oh, yeah, exactly. Then miege. That's why that we're nagging miege. If you know that, okay, this is how she retaliates. Okay. I was till it happens. Come on now. Ah, eh. Do you think Jelica knew that she can break windows? No. That's exactly. the thing. We also, un we also don't know what you're capable of. I've never done it personally, like going a, like a spree of like just breaking shit all over. Nah, man. No, I've never. But we don't know like what will happen in the future, how, where anger will take you. That's also a problem. So it's also yeah, just Jen, Jen. managing your own. Yes, yeah, I believe that. Yeah. To create poison. He didn't even wait for you live on podcast and chicks. Give it to Barn. Show poison. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, man, you live on podcast and chill, man. Sol is here, Ghost Lady is here, man. Jess. Yeah, sure, yeah, sure, yeah, sure, but it's money, belly, inking, and yana, man. Yeah, it's all a sagmela, poison. Yeah, anything, anything, belly, inking, and yana, and jelly, beg your command. So it's, I hate to attend into the syndrome. Okay, are you going to set the record straight anytime soon, oh, grand? He left. <laughs> What's happening? What's happening? I need to also. Ah, uh, we also Musa Kaula's tweet, so I'm sure that's what you're talking uh, about. Ah, uh, no, I don't know what you're talking about, man. I don't have a Twitter account. Ah, Nje Nje. Mara Nje Nje. Spone na spone na le alive ku jayam ku Instagram. Eh? Spone na le alive ku Instagram. Yeah, we bonya guban. Hey. Who's this not too? Eh? Who's this not too? 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 Who's this not
I can smell a heat coming. I can smell a heat coming. Shame, man. I go 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 she did. Oh. Come to there. Hence, you, I was like, we saw the live because she uh, went live. What did the she reason say? Stone Musa Kaula's it, like it, yeah, detective tweets. skills, yeah. mm-hmm. you know what I mean? She went live, bro. She went live, and obviously people record lives. Oh, okay. Yeah, which was like as she was, you know, uh, kicking him out or whatever. Yeah, man. Mm. So, uh, yeah. Well, in the, in the moment of anger, you guys, yeah, you just embarrass uh, your men and make, put them through the don't most. Don't make bro. it only about women. It's both ways, Saul. Uh uh-uh. uh it's both ways. Yeah, but you guys tend to uh-huh. be more. It's both okay. Both ways. Please explain. Yeah, but you cannot. The thing is, I'm always saying is that you can't just judge the after. Also, judge the the reasons, the cause <laughs> of the whole after of the aftermath. Okay, but yes, yes, but yes. Not I when, believe. I and believe I'm not justifying. Everyone must is responsible. Yes, is responsible for their actions, and you must. You cannot just do the extreme. Like for instance, as much as you are angry, I can't kill you. You get what I mean? Like I, I can't just decide. Oh, now because I'm angry, I'm gonna. You know, like at the end of the day, we need to also address the the starts. So. When you arrive and a man has hit his woman, are you one of those who ask, we ain't No, no, no. So, but that's, that's questioning the start. No, no, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. You see, those are different extremes. No, but when you break things or humiliate someone for the public to see, yes. and then I come and say, that's wrong to go live, yes. especially if you are kicking someone out. Yes. For, as a man, and and as anyone, that. that's demeaning. That. You know what I mean? I agree with that. But obviously some things are, can be also be done in privacy. Right, but at the end of the day, you need to practice the maturity of making sure that you do not take it to the extreme. Hence, it's about not taking it to the extreme. Whether it's about uh, messing up the whole house, you know, whether it's about um going beating each other up, when you oh, t- going live, exactly. Those are the extremes. That's why I say you need to be practice that maturity of just saying I'm not gonna go that far. Because it was the same thing, even but with MT. Again, and it's not a woman thing. Even yes. with MT, we were like, dude, why do you go live when I was arguing with exactly. this woman? Remember? Exactly. We asked the same question. Why do you go live? Unne- You're unnecessary. arguing with your person. Why go live? No one said, Maruyen Zain, yeah, for him to go live. Mm-hmm. There's some things that happen in relationships, like arguments, etc. And then there's other things that. You can't do like fucking invite the whole world and the when thing your is, shit also, is going so down. What I'm, what I'm very much pro is that because remember, issues don't start at the extreme end. For you, to, for it, for a relationship to get to the point where we are now messing up the house and all of this, some things are minor. Maybe she first um, just threw her back, you know, on the floor. Maybe there was a small argument and threw. So it's like whoa. Already address the issue when it starts. Like, okay, I see you've got a tendency when you are mad, you start maybe you 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 throw a glass. You understand? So already at the class, it needs to be addressed. We need help. So we stop this thing. And also, why did you throw the glass? Why did it start? Oh, because you did this. Now let's also address what are you doing? You understand? That's when now we can combat the issue of getting it so far. Now she's trashing the whole house, trashing the TV, scratching your car. But it started somewhere. That's where I'm about. Like, f- fix things when they start. When If you're, if you're against someone swearing at you, don't just ignore. Let's say... Futek, if that doesn't sit well with you, address it from that beginning. Not oh. when after years and it's like, but yeah, I get mad when you swear, but it's like you did at the first time they did it. Let make sure that it stopped. I get that. That's my thing. So that yeah, address things from the beginning. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> Futek, you didn't clap. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> no, no, but you, you are talking about just the extreme when it has come to the extreme, and I get that it's wrong. Yes, going live, yes, trashing or everything. And but it's it's okay to to say that was wrong to do. That was wrong. Obviously, I something agree. happened for it to get yes. there, but it mustn't get there. It mustn't. I totally agree. Yeah, she was wrong, right? You agree? Yes, she was wrong. And those who break TVs and yes, property when wrong. they argue, yes. you are wrong. Yeah, and those who simple. cheat, and you are wrong. Yeah, but you can't justify no, damaging justify, of property exactly. or your humiliation. But you are wrong, bro. You are both wrong. No one yes, taking true, it. True, yes. true, 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 yeah. true. But some reactions are unjustified. Thank you. Damn. I agree. <laughs> Uh, anything else you want to talk about, my dog? <laughs> yeah, man. People must be on the lookout, bro. So there was this lady. Um, she paid like 5.5 million rands. So there's a conveyancer scam that's been going around. So if you buy property, it's obviously the whole transaction is facilitated by lawyers, right? Yes. And um, you pay the monies to them, be it for the sale, be it for the deposit. And now there's a scam. It's been going around for a while where when they send you the email... Um, Sam will send an email with the banking details. Scammers intercept the emails, change the banking details, mm. then let the email go through mm. to you, right? Or resend it, but it'll look like it's from you know, the conveyances that you're mm. normally that you've been talking to for the few months. And that's a lot of money. That's conveyances, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Then you pay over. So some lady had paid like. It was 5.5. There was interest and all sorts Ooh. of damages in it. 5.5 uh, million. It went to the scammers. Mm. Um, obviously, she's thinking she sent the money to the lawyers. The money, lawyers didn't receive the money. And she went to court and uh, the court was like, nah, the lawyers are not responsible. Uh, no, no, that the lawyers must, must pay her. And mm. now it's been overturned that the lawyers were not responsible. And that's been happening for a while. So whenever you're going to buy a house, just... Call the guys now because it's a scam. Like scammers, AI is getting better. Scammers are getting better. Yeah. It's a whole thing. I made a 5.5 million. I think she was buying house cash. Yeah. How much is the house worth if she's paying 5.5 for conveyances? I'm not sure. No, no, it's not that, that's not the, the fee. That was for the house. house. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. yeah, you pay it yeah. into their account. To their account. Yeah, Jeez. that's how it works. So yeah, guys, be careful out there. And then do you guys buy from Sheen? Yes. My woman does, yes. Yeah, so David Tyler will be happy about this and mm. every local suppliers will be happy about this. Text. They're going to start taxing these motherfuckers like T. Oh, and she. Ah, nice, nice. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. No more care. Yeah. That means you're paying, you're paying more. <laughs> you're clear when you clear that card, you'll pay more. Yeah, but now you're going to buy something for almost equal to the price in South Africa. So you're not going to buy the dress anymore for whatever, 100 bucks. It's going to be 500 now. You know, like you normally do in South Africa. So Isn't she like fake? Isn't it fake goods? No, no, no. It's just really cheap goods. It's original goods. Oh. No, no, no. no. It's also just oh, there's know, also fast fake fashion. Stuff. There's also not even about fake stuff. Fast fashion. It's obviously not good quality material. It just, you know, yeah. it's, yeah. But it's, it's legit. No, it is, it is legit. Like, it is... It's not like Timu. I always see people com complaining about Timu. Yeah, like... Yes. No, you... no, no, no. People... Com like, the, the stuff isn't quality. Yeah. A lot of times. It's original stuff, but sometimes the stuff isn't quality. Um, it's How, just... fam, if it's original? I know original, someone who... <laughs> not everything that's original is quality, remember? Oh, okay. It's like... Um, some shops... Sell original stuff, but it's not quality. Mm. Okay. Like a, things it's like can a, it's be. It's like a wash and wear. Look, you know, man. you wear it once, and after you wash it, it just loses quality. And then, you know, sometimes the the quality of the clothing is just not that great. Oh. Some yeah, some whiskeys so are. It's not counterfeits. No, it's not counterfeit. That's oh, fake. Oh, some okay. whiskeys are like 120 rands, but it's bad quality. But it's yeah, not yeah, yeah. a fake whiskey. Yes, yeah, whiskey okay, actually, okay, but it's just you. like ah. You see, when you talk quality. about alcohol, made sense. That's why. Oh. I to, yeah. like, that's why. I to, you <laughs> yeah. know, make it make sense. You know, like, <laughs> bring, come to your world. You know, like, ah, yeah. there's, there's some shit you don't buy because it's just like, yes. it's cheap and it's bad quality. But some Spe people get off on that shit. Speaking of alcohol, uh, Chillers Punch and Granger is now available at ShopRite. Oh, wow. Nationwide. Wow. Also, we're out in Lesotho, Swaziland, Botswana, Yo. Namibia, and Zambia. We're going to be there end of June. Oh. So, yes. Uh, Ask Teshin. 
And then, <laughs> then hey, Pumalanga, we're coming this yeah. weekend. It's yeah. the finale. It's the last, it's the bom, last bom, 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 bom. Live Nation tour. It's the finale. It's the big one. Yeah, it's the big one. It's 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 gonna be amazing. So Pumalanga, tickets by I'm sure by the time this comes out, tickets would have been sold out. Yeah. Because we're currently Usually sitting at nine eighty percent. Yes, eighty percent. Wow, nah, definitely yeah. Be yeah. Be sold yeah. Out. So we're well, right? to win. Yes, I'm yes, not yes. Twin. I'm not twin casino, yeah. And then I uh, remember last week you were having me for uh, dropping uh, music like a quarter. Yes. I've got another quarter, but this quarter is special. <laughs> in a special, in a special. In a number one, in a special. In a number one, in a special. Yeah, 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 yeah. So remember, uh, we, we, we put on uh, Mac Lopez. And when I say we put on, like, we just gave him his flowers and. Yes. And, 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 and. Um, um, showed love to him, you yes, know, yes. and then he's gotten to do great things. Yeah, oh, bro, so he's, he's got Dubai. residency in and in, in Qatar now, so he's a resident Qatar, that side. Yes, shit, yes, yes. For real. yeah, he's doing Dude. big things. Let's just follow him. Wow, man. And then um, uh, we did the same for T Man SA, who's now working with Kelvin Momo. They did a track together. He's been in studio saw, with Cubs as well. So oh, he's cooking. Shit. He's flying. He, His days are coming, yeah, right? Nice one. So this is new kid, bro. His name is Say J Load. Say J. Lute. Sir, Sir J. Lute. Sir J. Lute. Sir J. Lute. So I'm what's aware. special about these kids, Ned, Ghost Lady, they are from the East End. Hmm. So Say J. Lute is the producer. But these are kids. And like, they they literally record in the back room. Wow. Actually, Shots, we must go there and do like a BTS, ne? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So people can see how these guys are making wow, this music break. Man. It's so fucking amazing, bro. Incredible, right? So uh, at one point, there'll be like 20 kids in the studio wow. just cooking music. And the song that I released now, well, which is going to release tomorrow uh, on Friday, is with a girl called, um, what's her name? I mustn't get her name wrong. But basically, she's, uh, remember that EP that I released, songs I put my name on, volume two? Yes. There was a song we did with her there. She was in grade 10. So now she's in grade 11. Wow. You must listen to this girl's voice, bro. So she's on this single that we're about to drop. Beautiful. What's it called? Uh, Impumelelo. Impumelelo. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So we're going to drop it midnight, but... Yeah, the song is special, man. Come Just on, listen man. to the messaging. Spiritual stuff. Yeah? Spiritual. Oh. That's how I was like, I'm in my spiritual bag. Oh, oh that's what okay. makes sense. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. So I won't yes. fuck my bitch. I'm not going to fuck me. Woman. Fuck a dance. The queens of this world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but, but check it out, man. man nah, this we'll guy, check it out, bro. This kid is crazy, yeah. man. This kid Luke is crazy. Maggie, yeah. Her name... Oh, I was looking for a name. Yeah, yeah. but yeah, it's going to come out. Yeah, yeah, Sir J. Luke, Maggie, and the girl's name. Shout out How's your song doing Are people like Doing you? well man Shout out bro Yo the reception is great man You know Gotta yeah. push Working on the video It's gonna Oh you're doing amazing. a video yeah, nice, yeah, yeah. nice It's beautiful bro uh, Okay let me just check here Let's say J. Loot I think it's Sandy or Sandy That's her name Oh it's Bootle, yes. Bootle, nice one. Bootle, Ndalo. Oh, it's Bootle, Ndalo. Yeah, B-U-H-L-E. Ndalo. Ndalo. This, 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 this girl is amazing. Oh. Yeah, but shout out. Check man. out and let us know what you think. Uh, anything else? from last year. Yeah, anything not, else? Not from my end. No? All right, Good. podcast and chill. We out here, man. Boom! Bye! Bye. So
Welcome to Black Excellence. Do not fear, for if you do, just sip on some grandeur. And if you still do, ask ourselves, what would Mapapunzi do? Parama chilla, itlesha lefiki. Bungo yig, even when they ask you, how sabi in, do not fear. For if you do, just say, Anistivi. This is the medicine of censorship. This is the pill. Which one is that one? Podcast and chill.